Hey everybody, Steven Krutzfeldt here. I wanted to get something out here on the internet because I was having a really tough time finding any information about how to deal with a specific error in Abby. Uh, for, what I have right here is a uh, Abby Flexi Capture for Invoices project. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and run a test quick and so you can see what I was seeing. Uh, as you can see here, we kept seeing uh, the document has hidden fields, some of which have errors. Now, if you're familiar with Abby Flexi Capture for Invoices, you know that all the fields kind of just pre-populate with what they believe the logic of the fields that you're going to need uh, are. So going through all of these different fields and trying to figure out what rule is causing the issue can be very time consuming, very frustrating. And oftentimes you can go in and see that there are actually no rules even checked. I have a database check because I want to have the uh, logic say fill in the information with the name if you uh, find a close match. But besides that, there's something like 60, 70 other rules that just come in pre-populated. So after unchecking literally every single rule, I was still getting the same error. Uh, after talking to some folks at Abby, they said chances are it has something to do with um, the fact that uh, we're going to find one that we actually don't want to recognize, maybe like net amount. So we can go in here, and if it says can have region, if that is checked, then that can throw an error. That can be one of the rule errors. So I made sure that every single one of my fields had that box unchecked as well. Uh, one thing that's kind of nice, you don't have to open it and close it. You can actually just go down the list, just click on each one, it'll keep it open. So we actually want to make sure that all of these are gone. The culprit though, and what I found out was the issue, and I should have known better because this was happening across multiple clients of ours. A lot of times they didn't want to scan in any credit notes, they only want to scan in invoices. And in the invoice and credit note, we go in here, th there could be options that say allow empty selection or allow multiple selection. You have to have allow empty selection checked or it will throw that error. So if we change that, make sure the credit also changes automatically. Uh, you can also set it at invoice type at the top here. If we do that and hit save, We'll go back to test, run the test. And we can see that error disappeared. So my recommendation, if you're running into that error, has hidden fields, some of which have errors, check first the invoice type, invoice and credit note, make sure that that, um, allow empty selection box is checked. If that doesn't work, go into your other ones, make sure can have region is unchecked. The other thing you can do is make sure recognition, you simply say do not recognize. Uh, that'd be another one. And then also does not require verification. I uh, hope this helps. I wish someone would have told this to me uh, a month ago. So I hope you find this helpful. Thank you.